social media activities through a limitation, I think that's something in your relation more politically than in the Osparic market. And uh, Cyborg, that's the, one of the top ranking you know, social media platforms in the SK Telecom platforms. Um, some of the innovation in, in Fission, which is a, a mobile IM and SMN uh, service uh, offerings from the uh, uh, China mobile. And uh, other mobile, that have a service, I want to highlight, you know, this is a mobile banking solution, and then this is a, a one for Germany, it's a backup service, backup the sync of the contact list uh, on, their, on people's mobile phone. And pay for IT is Orange uh, offers uh, mobile support services. I think, you know, Kurt will mention more about uh, the customer support and the uh, support issue uh, as well as solution out there in this afternoon's presentation. SK Telecom for cash, um, iCash solution is more a, a mobile e-wallet solution so people can use a mobile phone to do transaction, pay for uh, mails and the shopping stuff. And 11th Street, uh, that's a mobile auction services, just like eBay on a mobile phone. And then if you look at uh, China Mobile, this is very innovative because uh, people in China use uh, SMS so frequently, there is a lot of the SMS spam out there. So they offer service to fill out unwanted you know, SMS messages and uh, also provide a send receipt. You know, when, we, when we send out the SMS message, we make sure that uh, the receipt can receive it and see it. This kind of service is offered by uh, the mobile, uh, China Mobile try to um, offer some of the differentiated experience for the tunes. I want to highlight some of the key areas for the mobile internet. T-Mobile launched a web and walk services uh, last year and uh, has a experienced a tremendous increase in terms of uh, in terms of adoption. 65% increase of user base in 2008 and only cost $10 a month. And this T-Mobile's uh, plan is try to use the mobile internet services to drive up the, uh, the data subscriber numbers. And LG Telecom in Korea, they offer the odds of mobile internet services at very low price point, 6,000 6, won a month for one gigabyte private. And uh, it's uh, more likely to be an upsell for me because you find that a subscriber to the OS mobile internet services is more likely to consume other mobile internet mobile data services than average users. So the metric they tell us is 1.7 times higher than average users in terms of mobile data consumption. And the entity Docomo, because the mobile internet is so widespread and available in, in, in Japan, they try to defend their position compared to other offerings from like a SoftBank or uh, another carrier, I think it's the, the, uh, uh, the KDDI. So they offer a package hold that double plan, which is basically two tiered internet service options. For those less frequent users of the mobile internet services, they get a very low priced uh, one, uh, uh, um, one, one, one rate type of uh, service charges. As they move, as they increase their usage, they're going to pay a lot of heart for uh, some of the data packets until a point where they feel that they're heavy users they can pay an unlimited fee. So those are the type of you know, service plans introduced to the mobile internet users and the goal is to actually try to manage the data customer retention, reduce the churn of the mobile internet service, uh, mobile internet users in that specific country. Another service, uh, Mobile Music, uh, I'll have some example here, like TEC in Denmark. They launched this play service last year and it offers an access to unlimited uh, music download uh, tracks uh, at no additional charge to residential mobile and broadband customers. And uh, I mean, it can be a very successful experiment for TEC as at the end, uh, users of the mobile music services has exceeded 100,000 users. And, uh, the benefits is actually about customer churn. They reported that mobile customer churn uh, was reduced by 40, 30 to 40 percent after the play introduction. Uh, of course, there's many factors goes into that. But I, I think the the credit of, uh, to, uh, to, the, to the churn reduction uh, more to the play introduction than any other services of this point. SK Telecom they have been pioneering pioneering the mobile music service offering for the last. Uh, uh, five or six years, and they launched this uh, music services back in 2004, and now they have 9.3 million subscribers. And not all of them pay. Basically, uh, only about uh, 800,000 are paid 
uh, senior members, basically. But they find that by offering these services, those uh, users tend to uh, spend money on other type of mobile device, mobile services, including uh, single track download and uh, social media activities that drive the data usage. And uh, 